Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. It's always a pleasure to have you here with us. In today's video, we'll be addressing the recent data leak announced by AT&T, which is another issue the company has faced following the blackout in February. But before we dive in, we'd like to ask for your support. If you enjoy our content, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to stay updated with news from around the world. We'd love to have you on board. Now, without further ado, let's get straight to the news. Recently, AT&T announced the discovery of a theft of confidential information belonging to millions of current and former customers found online. The data breach includes information such as social security numbers and passwords of about 7.6 million current account holders and 65.4 million former account holders. Although the origin of the data is still unconfirmed, AT&T is investigating the incident, including whether the data originated from them or one of their suppliers. The company is notifying customers whose information has been compromised. The compromised information in this breach includes social security numbers and passwords, as well as full names, email addresses, mailing addresses, phone numbers, dates of birth, and AT&T account numbers. The affected data is from 2019 or earlier and does not appear to include financial information or call history. AT&T has already reset passwords for affected users and is offering credit monitoring services when applicable. Additionally, it is conducting a thorough investigation with internal and external cybersecurity experts. This is not the first time AT&T has faced data breaches. Although the company claims that the data from this latest breach surfaced almost two weeks ago on a hacker forum, it resembles a similar breach in 2021 that AT&T did not officially acknowledge, according to cybersecurity experts. Consumers can take steps to protect their information, such as creating difficult-to-guess passwords, using multi-factor authentication, and monitoring account activity for suspicious transactions. It is also important to verify contact information on official websites to avoid phishing scams. Furthermore, national credit agencies offer free credit freezes and fraud alerts to help consumers protect themselves against identity theft and malicious activities. AT&T is one of the largest mobile and internet service providers in the US, covering approximately 290 million people with its 5G wireless network. In February, the company experienced a major outage that affected tens of thousands of phone users, resulting in an apology and a $5 credit offer for those affected. And that wraps up another video from our channel. We hope to have helped you understand what happened and how to take measures to try to protect yourself from issues stemming from this new leak. Please leave a comment letting us know if you're a customer and if you've already received the company's notification, as well as what security measures you plan to take or not. Once again, we deeply appreciate your viewership. That's all for now, take care, and we'll see you in the next video.